words of the Lord given to Susan Davis on September 27, 2020. My coming is near, don't be fooled. Here is my word today. The hour is approaching for the church to take hold of their God. Are you ready? My coming is near. Don't be fooled by those who would lead you to believe otherwise. I am a God who keeps the promises I make. I am trustworthy and reliable. If you follow me and pursue me, you will not be disappointed. If you instead follow my enemy and those who follow him, you will be greatly disappointed and you will be chasing darkness, everlasting darkness. There is only one true way. I am He. There is only one path. Delight yourself in my ways and I will light up the way. The world believes on itself and that the answers lie within the human spirit. Only those who have my spirit will be found worthy to escape. All others will be judged according to their faith and their fruit. Without fruit, there can be no faith. Faith is demonstrated by works, and without works, faith is dead. Do not let anyone lead you to believe that following God requires no discipline. Only those who are disciplined in my word, through my truth, and by knowing me through intimacy are led by my spirit who alone teaches true righteousness. Without the power of the Holy Spirit within the person, they only have a form of godliness and deny the power thereof. Why be powerless in a world wrath with danger, evil, and my enemy at every turn? You are not safe without my blood covering and the filling of the Holy Spirit who comes to fill your oil lamp. Without this closeness to God, your eyes have scales and your ears are stopped. You will only see what you want to see and believe, but truth will not be your leader and you will be led astray. If this message is for you, come to me now. Waiting may be too late and you may not hear me when I call my church to come up hither. Take no chances. Come know your God in the secret place and be assured a place in my kingdom. Ask me for all truth and I will show you. Pray earnestly. Seek aggressively. Watch intently and run swiftly to me now. Amen. Matthew chapter 7 verses 13 and 14 Enter ye in at the straight gate, for wide is a gate, and broad is a way that leadeth to destruction, and many there be which go in thereat. Because straight is the gate, and narrow is the way which leadeth unto life, and few there be that find it. James chapter 2 verse 18 Yea, a man may say, Thou hast faith, and I have works. Show me thy faith without thy works, and I will show thee my faith by my works. Matthew chapter 7 verse 16 Ye shall know them by their fruits. Do men gather grapes of thorns or figs of thistles? Don't get left behind. Don't get left behind.